Hello and welcome back to the Kerbal Space Program. We are in the better than ever campaign mode and you are gaming with me, Brothgar. Now today we have a full stack of test protocols. Now, it's actually very important, as I learned throughout this episode, that you have to read absolutely every word when it comes to a test protocol to make sure you fulfill it as required. Now today we are attempting to fulfill the in-flight test protocol of the type 909. Now don't let this be confused with the Eureka 7 909. I'm actually referring to the liquid-fueled engine. Not really that big, not really that powerful, but as with the current situation, without a pilot, as we accidentally killed Jebediah last time, in-flight stabilization is going to be a big issue. Not to mention not knowing the rules. So let's cut to the footage and see how this all plays out. All right. Well, that's a cool rocket. I'm just gonna name that cool, cool rocket. Cool, here we go. Let's go to the launch pad here. We got the booster firing up first, and then we're gonna decouple, and that's just gonna fall away. And then we're gonna go on to actually fire up the second engine, get some altitude with it. Hopefully things all work out. There we are, sitting right on the ground. Good luck, Bill. Bill looks a little bit nervous, but I don't think he has anything to be nervous about. Although, putting pins that high up, I don't know. That could be some nasty air resistance. We'll find out uh, what happens. Good luck, Bill. Gotta remember the height, 19 to 27, I believe. Okay, we're flying. So far, we've got some decent amount of speed. Oh no, they're on the same one. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, hit it. Just 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 keep going. Well, the parachute may or may not work out here. I'm definitely testing the engine. Please hang on, parachute. Kind of made a mistake there. Uh It's got a long ways to go if it's gonna make this. Oh, I can fly it. Well, that's a plus. Of course, it's really gonna have issues with that parachute hanging off it. This is like all my missions. Uh oh no! Uh oh. Well, we've been here before. I just need a little bit more height. You know, Bill's really good at just improvising. Come on! Come on, Bill! Ah! No, 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 no. Come on, 500 more. Ah! Don't leave me short, Bill. Bill! Come on! You can do it! You can do it! You can do it! <laughs> well, I don't want him to die. But... Can I, uh... Oh! This is getting crazy. Okay. This is, uh... This is not going as planned. Oh, I'm out of fuel. I'm out of fuel. I didn't make it high enough. I was that close. That close, Bill. Oh well. At least you'll land. No! If we did learn something, you can actually fly these rockets. But well, you also really gotta pay attention to the sequences here. Because otherwise, you're in for some trouble. All right, so technically, apparently, this rocket has got to get all the way up to 23,000 meters. Um, oh, and it's going to blow up again. Technical difficulties. Whatever. Let's do it. Come on, Bill. Let's fire this beast up. I'm actually really enjoying how it's got fins on it. I think that's just really cool. It's pretty nifty. Pretty fancy. Pretty cool looking. Looks like a missile. Here we go. Let's give it more thrust. There you go. More thrust. 
burn off some of that fuel so you can actually start going up. Why'd you guys give me such a weak engine? I'm really not accelerating. I am maintaining speed now that the fuel is going down. I'm actually going higher, but now I've got an issue. Because I need to bump it back to center here. Or else I'm just gonna topple over. Come on, Bill. Work the controls. I now understand this little ball thing we got down here. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh, we're working hard now. Come on. Come on, Bill. I cannot see the height of what I need to really maintain here. I should have made my rocket longer. Okay, what's the height? What's the height? What's the height? What's the height? Okay, good. Cut her down. And we'll just rotate it over. Perfect. Decelerating nice and quick. Whew. Okay, good. Realistically, am I supposed to be... Did I mess this up? Speeds around this thing too? Well, whatever, we'll just go down. I mean, this seems like the best idea I've had. So long as we keep a little fuel to right our wrongs once we get to the bottom. Oop, don't go too fast, don't go too fast. We've got the speed. Perfect! And now we just need to level it out. Okay, hang on, hang on. Oh, you ain't never seen skills like this. This is, this is beast mode. Make me an astronaut today. This is actually how they do like recovering rockets. You've seen them. I think SpaceX is working on tech like this. So I'm just saying that's pretty legit stuff. Pretty legit. Now what's the height I need to do? Ah, I didn't do it high enough. I was too worried about, you know, saving my spacecraft. Well, you broke my spaceship again. What, did I not complete it? Was it, was that not satisfactory? Maybe because it blew up. <sighs> Difficulties. All right, so I have altered my spaceship here to potentially work better. At this point, I'm not so sure that's actually gonna work. What I'm gonna do is keep building scaffolding down, as the idea is at least, at least I'll be able to land. And maybe I won't need that second pair of fins there. Get rid of those, those are unnecessary now. And then we'll just put this on the side, and then we'll call it good. I'd, I'm just gonna go out on a wing here. Ah. <laughs> No! No, oh, come back to me. Come back to me, spaceship. Sweet design. Oh, no. You know, nothing technically says this has to land intact. You know, let's just face it. I kind of want it to be intact. Well, here's one for not knowing what's going to happen. Let's do it. Come on. Let's launch this beast. Bill, just to let you know, if you let me down, I'm firing you. Let's do this. This is the weirdest contraption. <laughs> Alright, let's keep an eye on these heights here. 27,000 is the upper limit for... Okay, so 27,000 pretty much... All I gotta do is get above 24,000. And then I'll be good. I'm starting to lean a little bit. But we're gonna correct that. Ever so slightly. Giving it more thrust right now. I think we're a little bit heavy. I think that might have to do with some aerodynamic, you know, resistance here. Or the fact that the scaffolding's a little bit heavier than I think it is. Come on, Bill. Give it a little bit more. We need more thrust. Look at how unstable this thing's becoming. It's, it's stabilized by the fins, not the fact that it has the mass in the right place. So it, it, it's eventually going to become impossible to keep this thing stabilized. 
Am I gonna get enough for the height though? Yes, come on. Good, 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 good. We can at least get one of the two. Not bad though, not bad. I mean, as far as measuring out how high this thing was gonna go, which I did my super calculations, which I'm actually just lying. I didn't do any. <laughs> um, I was able to at least build a spaceship that does kind of fly around. There we are. Oh, that's what's going on. Okay, so this is what's been going on. I'm supposed to activate that part at that current point. Which is what I hadn't been doing. So this rocket is not going to get me there. Come on, Bill, let's do it. This is all you. We're going to do it this time. Keep, uh, keep an eye on the mission log here. That's more like it. Um... What do we want? More power! That's right, we're fairly stable too. A slight correction and we'll be alright. I am currently way too low. Help me! We're spinning all over the place! These fins are not working out for me. Oh, okay, correct it, correct it, correct it. Don't correct it. Okay, now we gotta really think here. Did that complete? I'm not going fast enough. Uh, peace out. Come on, increase that speed. Increase that speed, Bill. Be heavy. Don't. Whoa, be careful there. Okay, we are at speed. And we have at least successfully done something. Yay! Good job, Bill. <laughs> ah, there we go. Did something good. We still lost some definite money out of that, but we got some, some points out of that. So that's at least something. All right, so we got ourselves a new mission. We need to test out a new booster. This should be pretty easy, actually. I like it. That one's going to be easy. And then we're also going to test this one in flight. Darn it. It's going to happen this time. I'm feeling good about this one. This booster looks really big, so I'm hoping it's going to really provide the thrust. Did I put two giant liquid tanks on top of a final stage rocket? Oh, well. Tested. We've already succeeded at something. That's the kind of test I like. Now, ever so slightly, we might need to bump this. Just a little, little, little tap. It's really not going fast enough. Well, I can see where this one's going. Nowhere. I'll be honest. I'm amazed. I'm still going up. I've proven the fins things is uh, quite unnecessary, though. Luckily, I got fuel for days, so this is just going to go on for a while. There's only one way I know how to solve this problem. And it's on the way down. <laughs> well, this is such a strategy. It might just work, actually. Okay, so I've rotated it back over, so now we're vertical again. We're just coming up on 700. We got the speed. We need the altitude. button bill bill how many times oh all right so this time's going to be different this time i ain't holding back we are going to get this mission and we are going to get it we're going to get it good i love it let's save this thing how much does it cost i don't even know it's way too heavy crap all right so, the test is, I gotta try these new stability enhancers. I've got two boosters on top of each other because they're cheap. And hopefully one's gonna be enough to actually keep this thing going 
upright. <laughs> don't know about that. And then I gotta pay attention, pay attention to what's going on. I don't know if this is gonna work. Good luck. Here we go. Woo! Now that's speed. All right, we are done with stage one. Here we go. Woo! -hoo 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 -hoo! All right, the rocket's getting kind of short now. I can feel it. It's really wanting to pull to the left. It's all right. It's not an issue. I've been through this many times before already. Oh my gosh, I can't. I can't focus on two things at once. It's too short. Did I not activate it at the right time again? Oh yeah. Well, this is a bit of a technical difficulty. You see the engine is left on, which is pressing it against, against my pod. Therefore, really making Bill sick. Ha, <laughs> um. And, and we're free. Oh! At least I got one test done, the stability test. Good luck, Bill. This one's expensive, so uh, don't blow it up. We got two big boosters blowing away down there. Those will be cutting out here pretty soon. They've gotten me up to almost 300 meters per second. And we're going to crank this one all the way up. Want to make sure we stabilize that out. Okay, my speed is climbing. Altitude is 10,000. Still going faster. The fuel is hanging in there. 420 meters per second is what I need. Okay, we've now reached it. Um, just going to keep it burning. Altitude of 22,000 is when I need to cut it. Okay, cut the engine. Woo! Good job. Good job. We have finally completed that test. It looks like I didn't have the right one. Test Sephiron in flight. That spaceship there seemed like it was just about good enough to make it all the way around the world, maybe. Try to throw this thing off us, huh? Come on! There we go! Well, there you have it. We have finally, finally completed that dumb LV-909 liquid fuel test. It was ridiculous. I can't believe it took that long. It should not have. It should have been like the first try, but sometimes it doesn't go your way. <laughs> Any right. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, maybe leave a like on the way out If you got something crazy for me you want me to try leave it in the comment section below I like to build crazy things just to see what's gonna happen. Thanks for watching guys. I will see you in the next episode. Peace Brathgar out <laughs>